Most samples we got from the so-called multicore. So there you have um, eight tubes, and then um, that one would go overboard. There is a pretty cool video actually that we took. Sometimes we had a GoPro connected to the multicore, so we could film what was happening on the way down. So um, the the basic idea is actually that it just sinks into the sea floor, and then there's a mechanism to close it, and then we would drag it. I mean, we would drag it up, and by that it closes, and then we get our sediment. On the ship, I worked in the lab. In the sediment, we I measured uh, methane concentration uh, using gas chromatograph, and um, I measured also um, rates of uh, sulfate reduction. The focus was very much on understanding methane and carbon dioxide. Methane is formed by microbes, but methane is also consumed by microbes. Um, and so one can understand, should understand the biogeochemical cycle of methane as one that is very, very tightly controlled by microbial activity. So our work was therefore focused on taking samples for experiments and quantifying how fast methane is formed and how fast methane is consumed in these sediments and in the water. The crew on Odin is just fantastic. They're, they're priceless. I mean, if there's the slightest problem, then uh, they would fix it. And um, also the scientists are always eager to explain what they are doing and show and maybe even let you try something. And um, yeah, very helpful as well. So that was really cool. It was, it was, it was fun to experience ice breaking. And, um, I've never seen so much wildlife. I've never seen so many polar bears, so many walruses. And uh, yeah, it was beautiful. So my hope is that we're gonna learn a lot more about those methane oxidation processes that are going on at the sediment surface and within the sediment and in the water column. I think uh, definitely the next one and a half or two years, we're gonna be very busy. It's exciting. These are going to be the, the first uh, data from this area, so it's a lot of unknowns. And I think that's good, that's what scientists are after. <laughs> yeah.